so hey guys to start off the shower routine we are going to start with our two cleansers our first and second cleanse and i made sure to pick products that non-sulfate so sulfate based wash or soaps are very harsh and they strip the skin for moisture so an, a beautiful one is this orx sulfate free body wash and for our first cleanse i'll be using dove's sulfate free gentle cleansing soap when it comes to gentle bar soaps dove has to take the number one and i'm pointing out to you that it has vanilla scent which it goes with the season the fall season you know it's all about coffees vanillas cocoa and all of that so uh, this is amazing the dove bar soap is a lot gentle dove are known for formulating their bar soaps with 70 percent i'll quote it if i'm wrong moisturizer so it's going to cleanse your skin without stripping it of moisture and you know during the fall and the winter season is a lot colder and as a result our skin is usually very dry so this is going to hang the boots on your surface based cleansers and to just make sure to move towards non-sulfate cleansers as not to strip your skin of moisture make it rough dry dull and lackluster and this cleanser smells so good especially that body wash that orx body wash it smells amazing like it's just the warmth wraps around you it's like a hot cup of chocolate it smells really really sweet and really nice and again it's sulfate free <laughs> so it's a win-win so i just need to throw it inside here and it's really affordable and it's amazing next i love to use this dr teal's epsom salt body scrub for my feet this is a salt scrub not a sugar scrub so it's a lot more coarse and this is the season of cracked feet you know cracked feet and all of that so i found out using this scrub every single day for only the feet though, in the shower is going to even make you ditch your your pedicurist is it pedicure yeah be manicure to ditch uh, the person in the salon because you, you are going to always have very soft supple feet there will be no cracked feet no excess dead skin cell but this is my secret for my body scrub now i'm using the tree haunts vitamin c sheer sugar scrub this does not smell a uh, fall or winter like this i picked it purposely because it contains alpha hydroxyl acids it has vitamin c you know during the fall season our skin this is why you want to go heavy on exfoliating even though it's three times a week you need to incorporate it because dead skin cells are forming at a very high rate now and i love this three hundred score because not only is it giving you physical exfoliation here yeah, it's giving you chemical exfoliation this is like my one of my favorite 300 scrub if you are following me here concentrate on the rough edges like your knee your elbows like all these things become so ashy you know and like the glow you get just using this in the shower is just amazing for my face normally this is the face wash i like to use which is the la roche posay ever class cleanser but it contains sulfate which is very drying so now i have to put that on the back bench and use my cerave and i'm not in the abroad but we are getting into the hamatan season in nigeria here which is somewhat the same with fall and winter where the weather is a lot more cold and where i am i'm in the northern part of nigeria and the hamatan season crept up on us very early because we are closer to the sahara desert and my skin has started acting up it's always itchy during this time so i had to change a lot of things in my skincare and that's why i'm like sharing this video and most of you guys following me are in the uk <laughs> and canada so you're always tuned in because of this kind of videos for feminine wash i'm using this natural feminine wash by my brand it's no fragrance no chemicals none of the nasty stuff just the good 
stuffs this thing contains cranberry extract which is like the powerhouse of feminine hygiene and it prevents uti gives you this protection it's ph balance is made by a cosmetologist in case you are just landing here for the first time i'm a cosmetologist and i produce these things myself and i have my own feminine hygiene and skincare brand here in nigeria so i love that thing so much one thing i've incorporated in this cold harsh season is body conditioner you know it's this extra boost of moisturization it gives you in case you don't know a body conditioner is something you use at the end of your shower you don't wash it out it's the last thing you use you apply it to your skin and you just rinse it out it locks in this moisture it gives you this supple skin it's like a game changer because this is the season you want to layer as many moisture as possible and i'm just concentrating on places that stretch marks tend to appear especially when the season gets cold and dry like this i deal with stretch marks on my arm and always constantly having to battle them so i'm just concentrating there because this only body conditioner contains retinol and retinol is like your best bet if you want to deal with stretch marks and all of that because it helps with cellular turnover and you know, shed of dead skin cells blemishes and all of that so i'm just allowing it to sit on the skin for a couple of times that's what i'm trying to tell you guys then i rinse it out and yeah that concludes my wonderful structured strategic shower routine for winter or any cold season even winter fall whatever and now we move on to after shower routine if you are an og here you know i like to start on my face skincare before my body so i don't mix products you know body products are more common the journey can they can cause breakout on the face so i'm just showing you guys the products i'm using for my face which is um i showed you the whew, the licorice face toner and the uh, snail muslin essence this is not the time to lean in towards hyaluronic acid Com contrary to what most people think oh go to go um hyaluronic acid during the hotter or humid seasons i use the cosarex um hyaluronic acid um, essence but now i use the snail muslin when it it gets a lot colder and that concludes my skincare and for my body i'm using this vaseline total moisture cocoa radiant rich fill filling lotion for healthy glowing skin and this is where it adds for me and what i love about this cream it has this cocoa rich cocoa scent to it this is really really a nice product because it is made to help give you healthy skin feed the skin barrier and this moisturizing total system that helps your skin to retain moisture and to lock it in so i really like this and it's not it, it really keeps the skin moisturized like they said but it's not greasy it doesn't give you that sticky gong kind of feel and all of that so that's one thing i love about it so much whenever it gets cold and we get towards the colder season like this this is one of the many body lotions i reach into i also like the um this one is very popular mm, i forgot to, but it's one of the many few and i like it because at the same time i want to moisturize my skin here but i don't want it to be very thick and cloggy and you know if you are og on this channel this is the time we do layering you don't just want to moisturize your skin with a good body lotion and stand up and be going we don't do body oils body oils are not moisturizers they are occlusives and they are meant to be placed on top of an actual moisturizer for my occlusive which is sealant and my layering method today i'm using this vaseline total moisture is by vaseline again and this is a gel oil that's what they call this formula it's not like your oil oil because like i said even if the weather is cold right i don't like thick and cloggy i do not like thick and cloggy when the weather is a lot warmer i do not layer i'll keep this oils one side and look for the lightest body lotion to use but now when everything is a lot cold and harsh and all of that i bring out all my layering oils but this is the one i always always still move towards this is what i'm always inclined towards i have other ones i could snap them i don't go i do because I, I don't like it you know 
I don't like the formula for them and all of that. I use only natural deodorants. I've been doing this for the past three, almost going to three years now. Only natural deodorant. And this is by my brand again and it's scented in vanilla and rose. Again, going with the theme of winter and fall for all the chocolates, the vanilla, the ch coffee, the cocoa, you know. It's I try to incorporate all those scents in here for you guys for that full feel and all of that. This is by my brand and it brightens dark underarms, you know, with natural actives such as vitamin C and kojic acid. If you don't know, deodorant is one of the reasons, top leading reasons that dark skinned women battle dark underarms. So just using a deodorant, you know, that is carefully formulated with active ingredient that helps to actively brighten the areas like a facial a skincare for the armpits on the go and it has really helped to maintain really really bright on the arms and i've got amazing results and um, feedback from customers where they're always clearing this from the shelves and all of that So you guys you can see how the skin is already glowing like people to achieve this way you see people using all the glitter products that there's a lot of mica and glitter in it glitter oil glow this glow that but just layering products right and using the right products can really be that game changer for you focusing on healthy skin layering moisture could just i'm being very intentional could just be it for you if you notice i don't also use towel i did not use any towel after showering i just put on my a bathrobe this is the bathrobe season so my body can absorb as much moisture as it can so this is me taking my leg from very ashy to very glowy so you guys can see i've even due for a wax on my leg but yet after doing this layering method with these two amazing products like the difference is clear the radiance is just amazing plus they smell so good like you can use <laughs> this and go out and people will be like wow you smell so good then imagine layering a perfume on it seriously this vaseline gel oil is just the best it's just amazing it's like <laughs> one of the best best no vaseline never ever disappoints at all like, look at that skin look at it so after i'm done doing that i layer my perfume and this is the nibra's perfume by the house of latafa it smells like chocolate raw cocoa like chocolate chocolate nothing added hot cocoa and nothing added <laughs> So that concludes my all my information for my shower routine. I hope you love the video. Don't forget to like the video. Comment below if you have any questions and I'll be very happy to reply them. Hit the subscribe button so if you love videos like this so you won't miss the next video. And until next time, bye guys.